Hey there guys, it's DJ. How's it going? Um, yeah, right now I'm just going to be showing you guys uh, something you can do to fix some problems with Minecraft. If, say for instance, you're uh, going through problems like uh, unable to install new mods, you get the black screen of death, um, unable to install texture packs, uh, having a problem with a black screen there. If you're having these problems, then I suggest you do this. Okay, so what we're going to start off with is a thing that everyone shows you. App data. Percentage signs on both sides. Right, so percentage sign, app, data, percentage sign. No spaces. Press enter. At the very top, or it should be at the top. For me, it's at the top. It's called dot Minecraft. Go in there. Now, you're probably going to hear on the internet that a lot of the fixes are delete your dot bin folder. I mean your bin folder, not your dot bin folder. It'll just say BIN. Now, you can delete that, but that may not save every, um, not save, solve everything. Go into your saves folder. Find any worlds that you want, copy and paste them into a folder on your desktop or wherever you'll remember where they are. Now go back and delete dot minecraft. Let's say for instance you're on a Mac, you can't find this, uh, or it's really hard to find it. If you're able to open up Minecraft, open it up, you know, log in, all that stuff, all that jazz. Uh, click on mods and texture packs, click open texture pack folder, and the address bar go back until you get to roaming. Make sure Minecraft is closed when you do this. Delete your dot .minecraft folder. There we go, it's been deleted. So there's no, not really any trace of Minecraft according to your computer. Um, close that down. <coughs> excuse me. Now if you don't have Minecraft EXE, excuse me, I think I'm getting over some sort of cold. Um, if you don't have Minecraft dot EXE, then go to you know the main page of Minecraft and you'll be able to download it there. Now open that up. And you're gonna have to put in your username and password. So one sec will I do that. Okay so I added my username and password. Click login. It's downloading packages which is the guts of Minecraft itself. <laughs> and <coughs> excuse me sorry. Oh, bad time to do a commentary. Multiplayer should work. Single player, you won't have any worlds. And as regards texture packs, you should only have the default. If you have any other files on this, then there's something remaining. Make sure that you deleted everything that I showed you to delete, which is actually only one thing. Okay, now that you've done that, either you do the trick that I showed you, or you do app or percentage app data percentage. I'm going to do it this way because it's quicker. Now, let's go into roaming. Dot Minecraft, right? Saves. Remember that folder I told you to create? Go in there, copy and paste, or just move the worlds into this, into your saves folder. Close that down. Click done. And when you click on single player, you should see the worlds there. Now, everything should work fine. Keep track of what mods you put on this. Don't use any patchers unless you're done installing mods. Excuse me, sorry. And um, ensure that when you install a mod, it's compatible with the other mods. I suggest keeping a list of them and having them in your internet browser fa favorites. <laughs> All right, I hope this was helpful, guys. Um, if you have any other problems, uh, try and contact me. It might be a problem with Java or perhaps another resource that Minecraft uses. All right, so I hope that helped in some way. I guess I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.